Ayo, ayo, it's your boy CJ and we back at it with another song review. Actually, it's a freestyle review. I'm sorry. And it is by your boy Marlon Craft. This is the first time me reacting to him. I have heard of him on Sway before. I'm pretty sure it's Sway. Or he's such a good freestyler. Like he's he's one of the top ten people that are known for freestyling, from what I've heard. And he's really made his name aware in the game. It's starting to slow down his fame, but I want him to start coming back up and start releasing songs. More freestyles if you have to. Anything. But it looks like he came out with this May 13th, 2020. And hey, he could he could be making music and I just I maybe missed it. So I, I don't think he's made music really as much as I like new music, but I could be wrong about that. So hmm. this should be interesting to me. I'm, I'm expecting the punches, the bars, the immaculate wordplay, word schemes, everything like that. But yeah, sorry if I'm an uncultured swine about Marlon Craft. I haven't really heard of him. And usually people cross my pathways a lot if you're a good freestyler like I like listening to freestyles so I'm surprised he hasn't come up on my radar more often but hey I might just do, I might have just been missing him that's all but right now like I said May 13th 2020 came out I think that was last week and it's called culture sick freestyle by Marlon Kraft so let's get right into this yeah. I feel as though I'm one of the best to ever do it. Okay. I said I feel as though for your ego, I know I am. <laughs> so fuck you. If you don't think I am, I'm going to tell you that I am pretty much. That's jokes. He's hyping himself up. I like it. I like it. Okay. I feel as though I'm one of the best to ever do it. I said I feel as though for your ego, I know I am. I yeah. this shit and turn it off after a second like those automated cars in Chinese. Yo, I know the scam. Ooh, <laughs> Chinese automated. I know the scam. Yo, I hate those people that ring you up. And you can just tell by the ringer. Sometimes you can tell by the way the phone rings. Literally, that's like, oh, this person's a scam. Or, or oh, they're so ignorant sometimes, too. It's like, bruh, if you're going to try to scam people, get somebody that can actually speak English and that knows how to scam people. You're like, come on. There's levels to that shit. But you just send some random person that barely knows English to, to, to try to scam me? Come on. Don't do that to me. Sheesh. While y'all trying to pass spam off for filet mignon, essential workers working tireless to make it home. Whew. I smell the smoke. Always talking about the struggle. I haven't heard. That's, that's cool. That's cool. Even though he probably doesn't know the struggle, he probably knows it from his past. So, and he's talking about essential work and whatnot. Okay. I see. Spam off for filet mignon, essential workers working tireless to make it home. Yeah. I smell the smoke trying to figure what to make of Rome. Rappers in quarantine still putting their makeup on. <laughs> Rappers in quarantine still putting the makeup on kind of reminds me of like MGK or something that's jokes I don't know I know that's not a diss to MGK but there's lots of rappers and they're not talking about the makeup I'm talking about putting on a new face putting on something that's fake I think that's what he means I <laughs> voice crack and I spit everywhere sheesh I think he's talking about people are and MGK would, hey, he's really showing his true colors. So that's totally opposite. I was talking about the makeup and I was being a little too in deep into that. No, but seriously, he's talking about these people. They're literally say one thing, but act the other way. They're not showing their true colors. Rappers in quarantine still putting their makeup on. Yep. Tired of looking at your mansions, interior design. Is this rap or is this an episode of Queer Eye? I ain't subbing no one. Was that a, was that a 6 9 diss? Was that a 6 9 Let's hear that. Area design. Is this rap or is this an episode of Queer Eye? I ain't subbing no one. See my PR expensive. No free shout outs for me unless I got it sent. Cause wise men shouldn't reason with fools. Only he who never wore a crown is eager to rule. Oh, who didn't wear a crown is eager to rule? Oh, that word play. I like. He's telling a story in his freestyle. I like it. Go back. Rewind. I. Oh. Do 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 do. Like, sheesh. That was a killer bar. I like that. 
I ain't subbing no one, see my PR expensive No free shout outs for me unless I got it sent right. Cause wise men shouldn't reason with fools Only he who never wore a crown is eager to rule I hold too many pearls of wisdom, I ain't need enough jewels I stand up in the throne, they blissful seated on stools Woo! Woo! Ah, it's not, oh, go back, that whole, like, l wearing a crown, sitting on the throne People are still sitting on stools or so Oh, okay, go back 20 seconds or 10 seconds wise men shouldn't reason with fools only he who never wore a crown is eager to rule Woo. i hold too many pearls of wisdom i ain't needing of jewels i stand up in the throne they blissful seated on stools pigeons shit. pigeon this is some shit i earn you can only take what's given to me oh he's getting some melodic tone in it okay i see what you're doing and i like how he says pigeon <laughs> that's jokes and this is some shit i earn you can only take what's given to me. Yep. And when my ash is in that urn, they still gonna be out here living through me. Yeah. And they want me to wait my turn. But I come from where ain't shit given usually. Woo. They could only hate my words. My soul is untouchable and fuck a corny OG complaining, but don't support shit. Yep. If you inherited this game, you the forfeit. Woo. Reason shit is fucked is cause y'all ain't leave no infrastructure. But they're whining about the culture and about kids and young shit. Oh, he's talking about some facts right here. Holy shit. I don't want to go too deep into it because I could cause, I could ruffle some feathers. Let me just put it that way. But he's speaking facts right now. Let's go back 10 seconds. Complaining, but don't support shit. If you inherited this game, you the forfeit. Woo. Reason shit is fucked is because y'all ain't leave no infrastructure. But then whine about the culture and about kids and young shit. Oh. You don't want us to be better, you just want to feel cool still. Yeah. You don't care if shit progressing, you just want an environment where you still relevant. But ain't no mentorship until shit is making big money, you don't stand next to it. You've been turning your paintbrush for cashier's checks. That's why on the low, you feel when someone reels next. Exposure time, I told you guys. Look, I'm done begging for respect from corporate seller. Oh, I'm done. Oh, man. He's really, I'm liking him more and more just from hearing the words. He he doesn't want to be mainstream. He, he's like underground. This person came from the underground. I believe he has. I don't know for sure, but I don't think he's no corporate sellout like he's saying. Like, he's him. Marlon Craft is him. You got to respect him for being himself. That's mad respect. Exposure time, I told you guys, look, I'm done begging for respect from corporate sellouts. Woo. This the new renaissance, this the you epilogue, so you can get down and you can lend a hand or you can get the help from off my back and quit testing me. Passed a million times and met all your hate with empathy. So do your fucking homework before you try to question me. Or I'll show you I should do my homework because I don't really know too much about him, so I felt that line. It would it hit me. Shit. Sorry, man. I'll do my homework next time on you, buddy. Times and met all your hate with empathy. So do your fucking homework before you try to question me. Or I'll show you pop quiz how reckless this pen can be. I oh, I'll show you pop quiz how reckless this pen can be. Oh, my goodness. Homework before you try to question me. Or I'll show you pop quiz how reckless this pen can be. Woo. I do shit the right way because it's the right way. Y'all do shit the tight way. All talk while lying in your pockets. Rap looking like the DNC. Yeah, like all these rappers nowadays are all in it for the wrong reasons. Mostly for the money and the fame. They're not doing it for the art. No one's really doing, like, it's really sad, honestly, that money rules the world and fame nowadays. It's not so much money anymore. It's fame. Like, it's crazy. And when, when you have fame, money comes along. So it's just, he's speaking some facts right now, people, and I'm loving it. Y'all do shit the type way All talk while lining in your pockets Rap looking like the DNC And if they do me like they did Bernie So be it Shit I'm done being nice I don't need it Don't act like I won't leave it all on the floor I was born for this Was that a Bernie Sanders? Woo! I see I like Bernie I'm a Bernie dude I, If he's talking about Bernie Sanders Rap looking like the DNC And if they do me like they did Bernie So be it Shit, I'm done being nice. I don't need it. Don't act like I won't leave it all on the floor. I was born for this. Ain't no time for nostalgia when the world in crisis. Shut down the whole globe for coronavirus. Ooh. And RIP the victims. Praise the frontliners. But when this shit is over, where we gonna make the culture sick? Seriously. Honestly. Out of this coronavirus, from all the shit we've seen in the media, what people have done, we've got to admit, we need to change something. We really do. We are sick. He's spitting facts. Facts, 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 facts. I don't know how many times I have to say facts. 
And R.I.P. the victims, praise the frontliners, but when this shit is over, where we gonna admit the culture sick? Not just the culture, the whole fucking world. That was sick. That was a sick... It, I don't know how much of a freestyle that was, but that was still too dope. That was really... Pulling on them heartstrings, brother. You make you making people think. And that's what I like when rappers do. It's not just about clothes, popping tags, popping bottles. It's about it makes you think. It gives you some knowledge so you can think about it. for the next years. There's songs that people have still been talking about because it makes you think. Like think about it. Immortal Technique, uh, Dance with the Devil. That song still gets passed around to generation on generation. I don't know how much it. Uh, that might have been that could slow down but still i remember that song and man that song gets passed down just because it means something and it has such an amazing story and like you said this culture is disgustingly sick things need to be changed asap but it's not because money's gonna rule the whole damn thing it's disgusting but whatever that's how shit is <laughs> but guys i'm gonna give this beat hmm it was a nice kind of, I'll give it a six. Not my favorite beat. Lots of people might love the beat. I don't. Give it a six, but his lyrics an 8.5. Just because they actually meant something, you could tell it was straight from his heart. He has good wordplay in it too. He had a good punch, a good, right at the start about, uh, what is it? It was about those telemarketers and oh he had some other good stuff i can't think of right now but wow that was really good i'm gonna be playing this a lot for other people to show them all right guys i'm gonna go right now and i love you so much and peace out